Okay, guys, so what we're going to do is add the command of uh, what happens when the bear touches you, so basically kills you. So you need to respawn, and we're going to make it respawn on the level that you're on. So to do that, you should go and find your bear blueprint. So here's mine. I'm going to click on it and open it. So you may see this here when you open it. So click on event graph, and you want to uh, add the code that you need. So um, I'm going to add it down here. Right click. And actually, what I need to do is click on the capsule because the, the interaction happens over the capsule. If you do not see this, make sure you move this over. So on begin overlap, click plus and it'll create uh, that command. And I just move it down a little bit. And what we want to do is cast a first person character. So meaning this will affect the first person character character right here and we're going to just have this uh, interact with the object so I'm just going to scroll over here and what do we want this to do well we want this to destroy the actor which is the first person character there it is destroy actor and we also want that that's first of our target self Okay, and we're going to add a delay here. So when the bear touches you, how long do you have before you can escape? Uh, I'm going to write one second. I think one second should be good enough. You can always come back and change that. And uh, what command do we want to execute? Uh, well, we want to uh, basically tell it what to do. So restart on the level once you die. You could say game over. Uh, console command there it is and what we're going to do is write level restart be careful on the spelling and make sure oh i have that wrong it's restart level so this is a command that's already built into the game so you need to type it exactly the right way um let me just double check this so this should be it so before i leave as i've already probably Told you a few times you want to highlight this and tell the game what this is because what you're gonna have too much code in here you won't know uh, what is what player is dead all right we're gonna go like that there we go compile and then of course save and now let's try it now you probably know this because we probably have done this a few times you gotta take the bear that's currently in the game because he does not have the code that we just added so what we want to do is delete him and drag a new bear in with the new code. So let's drag him in there and let's press play. So I'm going to go up to him. You'll hear the music that I added. As soon as he sees me, come after me. I got one second and I restart. Okay, there you go. Any questions, please let me know.